three different types of tomatoes. Each stage is a pot out now. The strongest is a sort of survive. Ginger's doing lovely. In here. That looks like a tomato. Beetroot. Potato. And it is sprouting, if I can focus in on it. Oh, what's that over there? Uh, that looks like pepper. The beetroot. Another sunflower, which is growing up next to my potatoes, which is seeding as well. So I'll go on top. Clay dish for my birds mostly, since I have the same as a beetroot. Let's have a look underneath, see what's underneath. Oh, look at that. Sorry, mate. You can have your space back in a minute. There we go. Sunflowers, I'm throwing them back on top. You can see mycorrhiza in there, but I can't bother to look for it. Pepper. Now, obviously, it won't all come to fruition. The difference in sizes. And the plant method. Now I'm on this big. You see, now the root ball is drying out a little bit. You can see where all these holes around the plastic start circulating the air around the root ball. That means you end up with fresher roots. Using this tray, then I can bottom feed. Seeing those leaves standing out, which means the roots are now drying, the ball is drying, and the roots are uh, expanding out throughout the package. So you don't water just yet, it's starting to look happier. Don't water yet. These are all lovely and happy, you can see they're all reaching for the sun. There's a difference in size. And then the soils. This is a week later. I'm just giving it another soak. You can see it's getting darker. Less chunky. It's going to get that. That'll only be left on for a couple of hours because through this window comes an awful lot of UV, so it does burn the leaves. But I'm obviously blowing them with cooler air, so uh, but the temperature's right. Well, I don't know if you can see it's about 20. It was above 20 just, so it is cooling. birds. Hello little birds. Enjoying the shade. My ginger will go out here. But I've got a tomato grow room to build first. I 
Anyway, potatoes are there. Also, potatoes growing in there. And there's an nasturtium as well, so I'll be eating that as well. Oh, and I think I've got some blue tits in my box. I've seen them scarper. The goldfinches. I've been sitting here and they've been feeding. Oh, what's that? Three foot away from me. I've been sitting there, improving on my tank. Well, I'm now on my albino glow. I'm trying to sort that out. My garden, I'm stuck indoors with pale skin. This is not right, mate. Do you know, I can't see what I'm looking at. This is Swansea on lockdown. What time are we? It's about nine in the morning, something like that. This is a habit. And I'll tell you what, my estate, it's a good estate, this is. It's not bad. The most challenged in these flats as well. I think they've been well behaved. So have I. I'm a good boy too. Kevin Engoid School out there on the horizon. That's Kilvay Hill. St. Thomas School on the horizon. And of course, Swansea. And in the distance, Ilfricum. Keep putting it off. Keep your heads down just for the moment. Everything's going to calm down soon, temporarily at least. Later.